What supplements do we recommend? Do we recommend Do I, You can spin it. Boom. You go first. All right. Uh, I personally don't take any supplements. I have. I've taken um, mass protein, uh, whey protein. Um, kind of helps my digestive system a little bit more. Um, the whey does. Um, and I haven't seen super big differences. I know a bunch of people talk about creatine. Um, my thought on creatine is there's this thing called adenosine triphosphate, ATP, another big scientific word you can use there. And so ATP is um, a chemical that you would use, uh, that the body uses, in the first five to 10 seconds, we'll say, of your lift. Um, and once outside of that, it's gone. So the beneficial thing of phosphate is that it just helps um, bring another phosphate ion, yeah, we'll call it ion, to the adenosine and tags it together so you can have energy quicker and replenish yourself. Correct me if I'm wrong. No, you're, you're good. I didn't do the best job of explaining that. But. So the simplest version of that is creatine helps me be more explosive. He said it the, the science-y way, yeah. and I just said it the non-science. Sorry guys. You said the same thing. No, that's great. Now they got a science lesson. That's how we, that's how we learn. <laughs> Uh, Curb cycle. What? <laughs> um, yeah. So I think what what Thomas is saying. I think I think the biggest thing is is we all want the supplements, um, but I think a lot of us have no idea what the supplement is actually doing. Mm. Um, and so imagine walking into GNC and the guy or girl behind the counter tried to sell you on creatine the way that Coach Thomas just explained what it did. You wouldn't buy it, right? Because let's be honest, that's 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 not sexy, right? What is is I'm gonna get bigger, I'm gonna get stronger, and so we see a lot of these supplements who are telling you something, but what they're actually doing is either nothing or not what you think it's doing. So, is creatine inherently bad? Uh, no, it's it's one of the supplements that, regardless of the industry or the company or the governing body, they're going to say, hey, it's safe for you, it's legal to use, and a lot of us are going to see benefits. Um, but at the same time, there are people who are not going to see benefits from something like creatine. And I think this permeates our industry. Supplements is a multi-billion dollar industry. They want your money, um, and they know that you're really not getting anything out of it. So I'll go two ends of the spectrum here. I'll go the stuff that does nothing which is basically every single supplement from your greens drink in the morning to your pre and probiotics to all of these crazy testosterone boosters, uh, cognitive enhancers. Uh, it's all just pouring money down the drain. Things that do work would be something like protein, okay? And why would I take protein is if you're someone who's busy moving throughout the day and you need more calories and you need more protein, I want you to take a protein shake. Right, uh, something like creatine. If you're an athlete who is doing a lot of explosive movements, I want you to take some some creatine. Um, let's go. I'll even I'll even give give a thumbs up for a green shake. Right, I don't think it does the benefits that it's claiming, but if you're someone who needs more calories, right, and and you're constantly busy throughout the day, and that's just something that's going to give you a few more calories, I want you to take that green shake. But what I don't want you to do is, is start reading the, the uh, performance, yeah. Yeah. performance yeah. benefits of this is going to totally change your life and you're going to whatever extraordinary uh, shit they're, they're uh, exclaiming, like it's probably not true. Um, and we're starting to see this more and more, even in supplements uh, like vitamin D supplementation. Is it good for you? Well. Maybe uh, if you are a split shift or if you're a third shift, but for a lot of us, I mean, just go outside, right? And so I think I think that's part of what we miss when we look at supplements is it's it's giving us this, hey, this is going to add X amount to your performance or health, 
when we just don't know enough about supplements to, to say uh, one way or the other. And for a lot of them, we do know, and we do know that you're just wasting a ton of money. Um, so everything we just said in a five second answer is go talk to a coach about what they think you should and shouldn't be spending your money on. Chances are it's going to be a lot shorter of a list than you're being sold. I think that's a good mm -hmm. summation of everything we just, all the, all the yeah. word salad that we just tossed at everyone. Exactly. I am jealous. Awesome. You have salad and toss. I see that. <laughs> I thought I actually meant to do that. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm jealous that you have two uh, acronyms and I have none. I'm going to have to throw in some acronyms for these next couple questions. Mm -hmm.